And that is music to all of our ears because the Hoppers were set to take on Hickory starting at 6.30 tonight. It is opening day and the first time that they've played here in Greensboro in 614 days. You know, the game is still on for now, but there are a few things you need to know before you come out here. You know, we have to go over the ground rules before we can have all of the fun. So I caught up with president and general manager of the Grasshoppers earlier today. Per the current guidelines, as we interpret them, uh, we will have 30% of the fire marshal's posted occupancy, which is right inside the door, which would mean 3,300 people. We have set up the seating bowl such that they're in, uh, tickets are available in groups of two or four, and then those are six feet or more away from the closest people to you. So we're adhering to the six foot social distancing guidelines per North Carolina, the capacity per North Carolina, and then uh, per Major League Baseball and actually per the state as well, all patrons, if they're not actively eating or drinking, are required to wear masks. Now, you may be wondering about that last part, mask wearing because baseball is outside. But remember, the governor's order says masks aren't required unless you're at a large gathering and a baseball game is just that. Plus, in the ballpark, the hoppers and the fans will need to follow rules set forth by Major League Baseball. So at times, those may differ from state guidance. And also keep in mind social distancing when you're waiting on the restroom or the concession stand. They want you to remember to be six feet apart. By the way, tickets are being sold in groups of two or four to keep Everyone's spaced out and there are player safety buffer zones. So some of the front rows may be restricted. But I also want you to take a look at this. We're up here in the party deck area, but as you can see, the seats are spaced off four seats and then these are restricted. You'll see zip ties around those so no one can sit in there. So they're really doing everything they can to make sure people are spaced out, to make sure people are safe. They're also doing some extra cleaning around the ballpark and they're getting ready for tonight. You can see the tarp is over the field. We're hoping that the rain passes by here so the hoppers can play ball starting at 630.